Hello everybody, this is Cap here with the fifth video in my Batch Files tutorial series. So in this video I'm going to show you guys something pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to show you how to write to a file, a text file, from your Batch File. So you use this do it using the echo command and the and two symbols which I'll show you. So let's get started with this. The first thing you need to do is find what file you want to write to. So in my case, in my YouTube's drive or YouTube drive, I made a file called text.txt. Oh, so select it, whatever file you want to uh, go down to properties and then find the location and copy it and exit out of this minimize that so now what we're gonna do to make it easier on ourselves is we're going to make a variable containing that path Let's say set file equal batch files. There, I forgot the S when I copied it. So you'll notice that our the end isn't actually here, our text.txt. So what you may have to do is add another little section there, text.txt, to let it know that we don't just want to go to the directory because there wouldn't that might be confusing for it and who knows what it'd do there and uh, we want it to go to that specific file within that directory so now let's write to the file we do this by using echo so echo followed by whatever you want written to the file this will be written to the file followed by the greater than sign and then our variable which contains the path so let's save it and run it okay as you can see it didn't print out anything which is expected we'll press another key to exit bring this up and then open our file and as you can see it wrote this will be written to the file into our file which is what we wanted to happen so let's see what happens when we try to do this again save it run it Oh, darn it. Must have closed out of it. Sorry about this, guys. I'll just go back to it real quick here. Alright. So, not exactly what we may have wanted to happen. See, it overwrote what was already in the file. So, what if we want to append something into that file? Well, we would use double greater than signs so if we wanted to overwrite what was already in the file and replace it with what we wanted to we could start off using one greater than sign for the first line that we wanted to put into the file and then all the subsequent lines that we want to append in to the file we would use the double greater than signs so save it run it and reopen our file here and as you can see it appended the second line onto our file which is what we wanted so that's something to watch out for when you're doing this make sure that you're not overwriting you know overwriting it every time or else you'll only get you know one line which will be the last one that was written to the file but if you do want to overwrite whatever's in the file this is that's you know a pretty good way to do it 
And you don't have to start with this. You can just append. You don't have to overwrite the uh, overwrite it first. Save. Open it up. And as you can see, it appended those two lines to the end of it. So that's a pretty cool and useful thing to know. We'll probably use it, hopefully, quite a bit in the coming tutorials. Uh, if you like this video, let me know by hitting the like button. And if you've watched a few of my videos and really like them, uh, go ahead and subscribe so that you can keep up to date on when I put new ones up. So I would like to thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.